Hello everyone and welcome back to the Joe and Maddie show. I am Maddie and this is my husband Joe. These um, people are really patient. What do you mean? They had to wait a long time for this one. What? Yes, yes. So, um, a bunch of stuff came up. It's the most wonderful time of the year. And Christmas. We finally are getting to the winter FabFitFun box. I did order some add-ons that were back ordered, which is why my box wouldn't ship. And I did end up getting those two items in the mail later. What are you doing? Can you not? I don't know what the other Can you not, was. please? Thank you. <laughs> that's... That's me. And that's Jonathan. We do weddings together. And this was my Christmas gift to him. Are, are you done now? This box was fabulous you know? and fun, but it was not fit because there's a fat guy on it. How do you know he wants to be in our video? I'm gonna ask him. He's gonna be thrilled. The, yeah, but he is. I'm gonna send him a link. So, Jonathan, shout out. I'm going to pull out all the add-ons first and see if I can remember all of them. Uh, but now I'm going to see them all. Yes, I know. Wait, I have a solution. It's no, like really no, tight. No, 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 you have to adjust it. Don't touch it. Why? That is, no, no. <laughs> you opened the box early. I need protection. They are selling more of the leather eye masks. So I picked one up. My other mask is Does mint green. Does it have like a cooling gel in there? Yes, it's mint green with the stars on it. This one also has the cooling insert that you can remove. And this is an, a baby blue with hearts on it. My only issue with this eye mask is it is really hard to clean. Um, you do get an, if you use the cooling insert, you do get an odor because our eyes have bacteria in them. So it's a pain in the butt to clean. I try not to put the cooling insert in it and I don't really need it anyway. It also- Wait, won't you can't put the one. cooling thing in there? You can. Did you not just hear what I said? Yeah, but I was enjoying it at the moment. You and then you said I can't have it. The two items that I was waiting for FabFitFun to deliver that I completely forgot about, that's how long it took to ship. Was this was... the item, remember way back when we talked about the item that you'd rub on somebody's balls and then send it back? Am I allowed to look now? Yes, you're allowed to look. You were never allowed to not look. Yeah, but you were digging everything out of the box. The item that I was waiting for FabFitFun to deliver that I completely forgot about was the Kula um, Classic Face Sport Sunscreen. It's a moisturizer for your face with sunscreen in it. Another spun gel in Mandarin Mint. Not too crazy about the scent, but it works. I would like to also note that the Freesia and Pear uh, spun gel that I really hated that I reviewed in the was that the fall box? I think it was an add-on. It was an add-on for the Can fall I open box. This? Yes, that one doesn't smell bad once you get it in the shower. It's not that bad. Certified organic, non-GMO, vegan, gluten-free. Made in USA. Certified bunny, leaping bunny. Made in the USA with thoughtfully sourced global ingredients. And it is endorsed by the American Lifeguard Association. Sweet. Next is the Etika 18 karat gold plated. What? Yes, I didn't even see that. 18 karat gold plated. This is one of the examples of where this I This is the most to... difficult box. What the fuck? There's a doohickey in the middle. That's to keep it from bouncing around. But nobody else does that. Pick like... a... No, other companies do it. Pick a side to put it in. Oh, that just didn't feel nice. I forgot to pick either the peach or the black. I ended up with both. So Can let me I... show you guys what it looks like. This is the peach one. And those are the black ones. Mother you know Rachel. what? What? Those would also make, they look like booby tassels. Yes, they do. Thank you for ruining these for me forever. Perfect. Are you happy now? I bet you I could make them spin. <laughs> I can't wait for the thumbnail of this video. All right, folks. The first thing we're going to talk about is the Mark and Graham color block throw in either two colors. You get gray slash ivory or natural slash ivory. It is $49. 
It's a tip to hand wash cold and lay flat to dry. Of course, I hate tan, so that's the color I ended up with, go figure. I think the idea of tan and brown has been ruined forever in our brains because our reno house happened to be in brown and tan. And in my opinion, I'm a clean freak and I feel like it's very hard to keep tan looking clean. When you pulled it out, I thought this was ugly. Yeah, it is ugly. It's just- I thought it looked like the blanket that they like wrap baby Jesus in. And then I touched it. And it feels like it. And it's soft. Is it? Yeah, you like it? I don't think it's I ugly. like it, but it has to go with the eye mask, so I can't see how ugly it is. Have you been waiting this long to open all this stuff? I haven't opened anything. Why do you think I've been so mad? I'm pissed. I haven't been able to use any of my things because he'll see them. Okay, so... You're right, I would definitely pick out an ugly burlap sack in the middle of our room. Yeah, look, look at that. You look like, away in a manger, however that song goes. Cookie, that's really expensive. There. I made it good. Well, Luna's oh. jealous. Family photo! Uh, next is the Moroccan Gold Series Treatment Mask. So I chose a treatment mask over a headband and pop top glove duo just because I have club thumbs so they fit weird in gloves and I don't really think the quality, like the quality of the gloves can't be that great. I'm very picky with that kind of stuff. So I picked the treatment mask and because I have practically no hair now, this will last me a really long time. It says after shampooing to leave the mask in the hair for five to seven minutes and then rinse. This smells not good. I'm getting old lady perfume and baby powder again. I don't know why they keep doing that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ah, geez, ooh, this is terrible. bad. I've heard good things about the Moroccan Gold series. I know a lot of people like their shampoo. This is my first time using them, so I'll be excited to see what it does. It says seal split ends strengthen hair and make your tresses more manageable with this fortifying blend of argan oil and keratin components. Next is the H. Halston Jewelry Portfolio. Um, I had a choice between that, a dry shampoo, and a circle necklace. <laughs> This is worth $48. It says, uh, keep your jewelry tangle free. This large zip around portfolio has three orga organizational sections to fit rings, bracelets, necklaces, and more. I really like this. I have a cheaper jewelry organizer that I bought from one of our cruises. It's made of like makeup bag material and the way it works is it's probably about the size of my palm and they're different zipper compartments that fold over each other. So if you wanted to section out your jewelry but based on days, you could do that and then it all zipped up. But I wanted something a little more substantial, maybe, maybe to put in my night table. I usually put my everyday jewelry in a more accessible area. A little zipper pocket here. This is a snap for earrings. I took your nipple tassels off. Okay. These all snap. Um, and then on the other side, you have your, your snap for, oh my gosh, why am I brain, brain farting? Necklaces. This kind of looks like a, like a bougie thing. People would keep their iPad mini inside. That doesn't feel like it's worth $48. No, you're Feeling totally right. Feeling cheap to one person might be different for the other, but that doesn't. No, like that feels like some five below shit right there. Yeah. I have something in here for you. I got a gift for you. Um, I didn't- Finally. I think I got to choose this too. Is it boobies? No. I got to choose between a pair of, a pair of socks, a pair of $24 socks. What? A pure be yourself -y palette. Again, don't care about. I bought the Sherry Matthews Acupuncture Jade Stone Roller. And it says, it's no wonder this anti-aging beauty tool has been used by empresses for centuries. This jade roller helps stimulate chi and promotes a feeling of facial relaxation. Gently wipe clean with an alcohol pad after each, each use. Yeah, this is supposed to be an anti-aging product, but the reason I saw it is because Joseph has some undiagnosed health problems, and one of the symptoms is his face gets really hot at random times. And I have a cold stone that's made of marble that he uses, but I just thought this would be better because of the roller, you know, it would be able to cool your face more efficiently. Not sure that would do anything for your skin. 
Ooh, oh, it's chilly. That would be perfect. I was about to call myself pretty gay, but I'm not allowed to say gay on this channel. I was gonna make fun of this, mm -hmm. but it feels pretty nice. Yeah. All right, but I told how much you is like it? it. Like, how much are people paying for this it's rock cool on a stick? It's a $45. That's been in the add-ons for months. I'm wondering if anyone actually buys it. I think it was like, add-on, add-on, add-on. And then they were like, all right, well, now you have a choice to get it in your box. Like, they're what really pushing it. I don't know why. What is this rock made of? That's jade. Would you pay $45 for that thing? Yeesh. Okay. This is the Bite Beauty Amuse... Bougie? Just, Does that one. say bougie? This is a high impact lipstick in a peachy nude shade. This lipstick is handcrafted to deliver moisture and creamy wear. Okay, I don't normally like lipstick. I've always wanted to try Be Bite Beauty. I've heard really good things about them, but because I rarely wear lipstick now, I couldn't justify the cost. So I'm actually gonna put this on today and I'm gonna show you guys how nice it is. Hey. Well, that was a disappointment. Do you think all the girls that get these boxes, do they just sit there and open all this stuff like all at once like you do? I don't know. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Um, I have, I think I have fairly pigmented lips. I don't know if about, I don't know enough about makeup to know, but I feel like this just put a yeah. really warm, it put like, it made my lips more warm toned. Like a peachy, them. it's like a peachy brown. Yeah, it made them shiny though. I don't like it. Okay. There we go. Is that what happened? You can see how peachy the color is. You know who would like this? My mom would probably like it. See, again. It's not a regular lid. It's a lid with a little whoosh. Those they... lipsticks are 26 bucks a pop. <laughs> That's why it is pretty nice. Like, mm -hmm. like the packaging. Like it feels expensive. Yeah. Besides the blanket, this is probably the worst thing I got in the box. I got the Way of Will Elevate Essential Oil Set, Sweet Orange and Eucalyptus Oil. Unlike typical essential oils, these oils can be applied directly onto the skin. I wouldn't do it anyway. This is $31. I like the box, the box is cute, but other than that, I'm not really interested. No artificial coloring, 100% natural, no animal testing, that's nice, no synthetic ingredients. I've never heard of this company, but we all know what essential oils are. And yes, it's true that there are different grades, but I think it's really dangerous to be telling people that they can take tips and advice about a substance that can potentially harm you if you don't use it properly. Let's head to page 20 and see what kind of stuff they're telling you to do with it. I remember when lavender lemonade came around when the essential oil craze was big, and I really don't suggest ingesting oils if you don't know what you're doing. Please, 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 please talk to someone who knows what they're talking about. Um, I know that in the state of Pennsylvania, I'm, I am a massage therapist. There are continuing education classes that may be open to the public and you can learn how to properly use oils. I would never put an oil directly on my skin. And, and let me reiterate, I am not professionally trained on how to use essential oils either. That is something I could do in the future, but I have not done it now. You really want some sort of carrier oil that you can mix on your skin purely for the part of whether it's safe or not you might have sensitive skin i like this one the yes sweet yes I that know other like one smells orange. like <laughs> apply topically to sore muscles use on the temples put three to five drops in your shoe okay that's probably the only one you can get away with thrive cosmetics brilliant eye brightener in stella infused with macadamia and meadow foam oil i have no idea what meadow foam is this silky champagne eye brightener instantly highlights and brightens your eyes. Oh, it's an eye brightener. I thought this was a highlighter. As you can see, I did just pop that on my inner lid. You have this applicator. It's kind of like a crayon and um, it is retractable. Let's see how much product we get. We probably won't be able to push it back down. Damn, that's a lot of product. That's a lot of product. See, look. <laughs> Are you used to working with something like that? What? Uh. Ahava Hydration Cream Mask. Enriched with mineral spring water, shea butter, and vitamin E, this rich creamy mask softens and smooths the skin while providing intense hydration and comfort. This better not smell like the water one. I'm gonna be pissed if it does. This smells like massage lotion to me. Black Hydrogel Eye Mask with Hyaluronic Acid. Is your under eye area puffy or swollen? Detox and depuff with this activated charcoal eye mask for a refreshed look. 
I'm confused. Where am I going that I'm going to need to refresh my eyes real quick? When you girls go to the bathroom in fours, we have no idea what you do in there. Oh, we're talking shit on you. Late nights, too many cheeky wines, and let's not forget, those low carb on carb delights can have your peepers looking, well, not so fresh. Leave the evidence of last night behind and pop on our activated charcoal eye mask to de -puff, detox and get back to your shiny, gorgeous self. I feel like that's the kind of person who would be saying that to yeah. like the like the poopery lady. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I love that commercial. <laughs> yeah. She'd be like, I shit, but I want it to not smell like shit. Getting ready to leave your house and looking like shit. That does not look pleasant. How to www.black.co for details. Okay, if oh, I have to, word, so. if I have to check the website and there's an instructional video, this is too much for me. How long do you have to leave them on? I don't know. We have to go on the website. Uh, you get five of these for thirty dollars. It's like when you open a Coke, you know, and they're like, "Oh, you might be a winner if you go to www." And nobody gives it. Nobody cares. Nobody gives a shit. Dot com. Yeah. Mhm. Mm perfect. Before I forget, I've noticed an Wait, item in are here. Are we gonna do that last? Yes. I've noticed an item in here, and it turns out it's not part of the box. It's one of my add-ons that I forgot about. So this is certified organic. The product is vegan. It is not tested on animals. This is the Grown Alchemist Matte Balancing Moisturizer with acai berry and something else I can't pronounce, borago. I am not reading all of this shit. Like, it's like eight point font on the entire, yeah, no. You need to put this in the bathroom when you take a shit and you forget your phone and you're like, oh, thank God. Well, don't Stephen worry. Stephen King novel. Don't worry, because it looks like they printed it on the bottle, too. <laughs> Show how much. Like the whole bottle. And, and it's on the other side. Room. Like, oh. Yeah, there's the other side. I think side. there's a whole newspaper on here. Dr. Bronner's does that, too. Did they even have room for the name of the product? I don't know. This was expensive, but I really like the Grown Alchemist products I've used so far. This smells like that OG Amber Dial soap. Let's Am look I up the video. Them, or do they go under your eyes? Bl I have to go to blaq.co. So many questions. I can't find anything about it. All they have are effects and questions on the website. Like, it's not telling us how to use the product. Should I rinse after using the eye mask? Rinse, don't rinse, do whatever feels right, babe. But if the windows to your soul are a little sensitive, then we would suggest to rinse off any excess residue. These fashion sites are weird. So it sounds like we can just do whatever the hell we want with it. Oh, 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 they look Get like the box little, out of the way. They look like little leeches. Oh, they look like the leeches from Stand By Me. Oh, ew. Like huge tadpoles. Ew. <laughs> oh, they're like. Ew, they're. Oh, they're so, these are so unpleasant. I'm doing my own. Yeah, but I don't understand. Is the, does, is the fat side on the inside or the outside? Do whatever feels right, babes. I look, like, like, a, a football I look like a panda bear. <laughs> yeah, you do. <laughs> Wait, where did these directions come from? Oh, there's directions. Google figured it out. But it's not from the black website. It's from a completely different website. So... 10 to 15 minutes. See, like that, you need to know. Can't just be like, whatever feels right. Five minutes or seven days. Oh my god, it says it on the actual product page, not the facts and questions. Why well, would you do that? Tom is so jealous of me right now. He's like, dude, didn't share any of that with me. That was way more work than it was worth. I feel like- It always is. Trying to figure out the directions for this was almost worse than trying on that other eye mask, or that face mask. Like, Which there was needs the to be... hot mess express. Do you know what this video is gonna be? This video is gonna be like five minutes of all that shit, and then an entire eight minutes us just bitching about this eye mask. Let's talk a little bit about the box. Let's talk about the box. So, I'm still having really mixed feelings about FabFitFun. What do you think about this one? I don't know, I liked your idea of we'll like buy other stuff. Cause then you can make fun of what I buy. I'm just making fun of all the girl stuff. You need to be like, ta ta ta, and be able to fight back. And they are items I will use, but it's really hard for me when I get a ugly ass blanket 
and cheap ass jewelry organizer and I'm supposed to believe that they're worth the money that they tell me that they're worth. I like this and I like this. Even though it's stupid. Cause like you go to the store and you pick up what you need. This is just random stuff that, hey, maybe you didn't need this, but now you got seven. I put a wet piece of rubber on my face for 15 minutes. Yeah, so those were our personal opinions of the FabFitFun box. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Let's get it edited. People need this. What?